Hi, my name's Kate. I'm the clinical nurse educator at Asthma WA. You've probably heard about the Paediatric Respiratory Hub. We're up and running again this year, which is fabulous. Uh, in case you aren't fully aware of how we work, we are a hub. So this is a fabulous place for our families with children with asthma can come. They can get a full lung function testing, see our specialist and get a good education about their asthma and their medication from one of our fabulous asthma educators. This is a unique service that brings all these important services together. So our families can leave here with a better understanding, more confidence about how to manage their child's asthma and certainly a drop in their anxiety. And hopefully our children can go on to lead really healthy lives as they're living with asthma and keep them away from hospitals and keep them happy and healthy. Uh, so we first uh, realised Mia had asthma when she was about two or three years old and that was kind of picked up from constant um, uh, chest infections and uh, going to the hospital and then since then it's kind of developed and gone uh, up and down so she's symptoms go from severe to mild, severe to mild and uh, trying to manage it has been quite difficult. Prior to the Paediatric Respiratory Hub being formed uh, there was a big gap, I believe, uh, for families that have children with asthma. Um, the main reason for that is there was nowhere to go for paediatric lung function. There was also um, a lot of confusion when kids jumped in and out of hospital and seeing their GP without the two really meeting. Look, asthma can be really difficult for some of the families, particularly if they're in and out of hospital and particularly if they are unsure of the diagnosis and we're hoping that with this service for the families they can come to one place where they can get some objective measures about how good their child's asthma is. They can see the educator and they can see a paediatric respiratory specialist and then get a better understanding through that conversation of where their child's at. And it provides another link into the asthma education network because I think sometimes families don't understand the value of that and you can't put a, like a dollar sign to how important that is at the end of the day to be able to pick up the phone and talk to someone about your asthma. And when they finally realise that Asthma WA actually has a service that runs near, near to them where they can come and see a person and they can pick up a phone and just ask what do I do next, I, th I think that is probably the most important thing that we do is trying to link their GP and the hospitals together and to provide a bridge to all of those things. Once we receive the referral from your GP, we'll contact you to arrange an appointment for your child to attend the Paediatric Respiratory Hub. It's really important we get a good history about your child's health and what your concerns have been. We can discuss that prior to the appointment or at the Paediatric Respiratory Hub. During lung function testing, I will assess the all-important device technique with the spacer and the reliever and make any necessary changes and we'll also discuss asthma first aid. Uh, the hardest part getting to this point has probably been the trying to see the right doctors and go to the right places. Um, we've got a really great GP who manages us really well but it's been difficult to know the next step from there. Um, we did see a private respiratory specialist but there's long wait times and we um, actually had an appointment and um, missed her, her appointment because she was in hospital with asthma um, and then had to wait another nine months to get the next appointment. So it was just long wait times and trying to get control uh, was difficult. Um, it's yeah, been really great having the paediatric respiratory hub where there's just a one-stop shop, you can get tests done, you can have uh, advice, but also see a specialist in, in one place. Asthma is one of the most complex chronic conditions that affects so many people. In fact, one in nine Australians have the condition and one in four children will go on to develop asthma in childhood. We take our breathing for granted until we see a child gasping for air. And although currently there's no cure for asthma, children can go on to lead normal active lives if their condition is well managed. And at the Paediatric Respiratory Hub, that's what we set out to do. Thank you to Telethon, Stan Perrin Foundation and our generous donors for making this life-changing service possible.